Alexa versus Muldan. Your soul shall be mine. Warlock. Begin. I think it should be control or even. Even is probably the biggest issue for me, but I'm not sure if I should keep Hunter's Mark due to that. If I know it was Sue, I would definitely keep Explosive Trap and probably then also Flanking Strike. But I doubt that in the top 100 there's anyone playing Zoo. Sorry, Hard Mulligan. So he's probably Q block. Come on, give me a playable card. Mm. Well, we do have removal, right? So whatever he does. We likely remove. Oh, interesting. So he's Mechathun, alrighty. Can we lose against Mechathun? I don't think we can lose. Not if we hit that button and send stuff to the face, right? I don't think we can really lose, but we'll have to see. That's definitely annoying, wow. That's a lot of healing. Hmm. Is, am I really gonna get overrun here by Mechathun? That would be nuts, right? I think we play that Baited Arrow on the 2-1 here. We need to get rid of that 4-4 quickly though. It's the most important card I think to get rid of because we don't want him to get that much healing. How are we gonna do that? I don't see it, right? But I, I think this is the best tempo because we are developing a 5-5 against his 4-4. Uh, that should be okay. And we do have Crushing Walls in the worst case to remove that Divine Sheet minion. He has a Spellstone here or something. Skull of the Maneri? I am confused. What? So that means Doom Guards are coming? I'm gonna try to look up that deck list. He runs Galvanizer. Let's gallop them in area together. Mechathun Warlock, what can come out? Ah, he plays Void Lords. Okay. That's the only big demon that can come out. Alright, so Void Lord cannot kill this. I think it's a good idea then to play it. Oh, nice, he didn't even have anything. Pretty good. We we'll probably catch a defile here or something, but yeah, it's all right. So does he run Hellfires for sure, right? Well, one list runs to Hellfires, the other list doesn't. Hmm. What to think about that? Let's empty the hand then and just play the spellstone nonetheless. I think I'm fine if he plays Hellfire. I think I want to push that button so that he's not able to play Mechathun. The end is coming! 
Umsaya doesn't really do anything, right? Hey, Mr. Merrick. Rushing walls should be fine here. Well, we can also develop the subject nine, honestly. If we play Hunter's Mark, that's probably better, right? We draw the useless cards and play the Hunter's Mark. And I definitely prefer the hero power here, I think, over that um, trap. He still holds the coin. Maybe I should play the red trap. Whoa. My hand is too Interesting. Should have played the red trap probably. <laughs> but we do have a nice crushing walls here coming. He's not gonna make it, right? We finish him off early. We almost have it this turn. Almost. I think I take the kill command here. Set him to one. Then he needs to heal and clear the board. I don't think he can win any regular game against me. So... We don't win with Rexa yet. We do win if we find kill command. Let's try to look for kill command. We have Suljin. Suljin is probably a strong play next turn. We are definitely going to hero power here. And then we play that red trap. And do these attacks. Which secrets make the most sense? Well, he's never gonna attack face, right? So I think this one and this one make the most sense. He wants to play Gul'dan here, right? Yeah. That's quite annoying. That's a lot of healing. And a lot of big guys. We might be forced to play Rexa now. Mm. We can also play Zul'jin though, it's kind of good here, I think. We get another Crushing Walls. Oh, come on. Billy, face. Wow! Two nukes into my face? That's mean. Okay, at least we didn't burn the kill command with the tracking. That's a 1, 2, 3, 4 D file. He wants to do that. Mm -hmm. He's gonna go for that. He's gonna go for the kill right now on me, right? There's still one more Hellfire in the deck. Uh, what I gonna do with you? 
Do we need Rexar? I think we do need Rexar. Kill command is not enough damage, right? The other alternative route is the secret keepers. We can buff them to be both at four health. That seems kind of interesting. What's he gonna do against two secret keepers with four health? I'm not quite sure. Because he has the hero power with 3 damage. He might get another Void Lord though, that would suck. But well. Okay, at least no free Void Lord, that's good. One of the last cards is Void Lord. So there's one more Hellfire. Oh, twisting that other, that's really annoying, damn it. Wow, it really looks like he's gonna win, right? We need to get good minions soon here. Holy moly, I didn't think he could beat me. But it seems like he can. Especially if he gets that other Void Lord, I'm never gonna break through, right? I'm never gonna break through. Wasp, I suppose. Okay, that other Void Lord seems to be buried deep down. That's very good for me. There's no more snipe, right? But now, okay, he gets it from the lackey. Man, that's rough. Okay, we have a deadly shot, though. Mm, but it's not gonna be enough. The small taunts are too good here for him, right? Mm. But we always do this. And grab a little bit extra armor here. Cannot kill this, right? I think I play the kill command here just because I have the spare mana. And the rest is not really important, right? So the question is what stuff does he have left? I'm almost out of cards. We need to find a big charger, I think, here to win. Because he's at 16. Can he play the combo immediately? Or does he need to empty the hand as well? One can never attack face, right? But I think we lose. Really looks like we lose. I'm not sure, can he play the combo now immediately? Probably, right? Because he's at pretty high health? I think so. With 15 health he can do it, right? Damn it! Mm. He only needs 4. Interesting matchup though, interesting matchup. <laughs> we still get that red trap going. <laughs> 